you're past the greeter at the L.A. Auto Show, it's time for <laughs> Sensory Overload. There are new models, and, well, models. There are cars with bling and cars with wings. Fast cars, family cars, there are grills, and then there are grills. But amid all this grand, glitzy, auto culture glory is a new arrival, long the subject of rumor, whisper, and promise. So, ladies and gentlemen, the Honda FCEV concept. You should be able to put one of these in your garage in 2015. Fuel cell vehicles are cars that turn hydrogen to electricity and emit only a little water. Drive one of these and you're free from gasoline, help to clean the air, and fight climate change. But this Hyundai Tucson, also introduced in LA, will be the very first fuel cell production passenger vehicle mass produced for the American market. And it's available in the 2014 model year. There are a small number of fuel cell vehicles on the road in California, and they're quite different from other zero emission vehicles. Battery electric vehicles work really fantastic in smaller platforms, uh, smaller cars, and for people who have a pretty well-defined range, um, their daily driving habits. Hydrogen fuel cell cars um, are fantastic for uh, vehicle needs um, in larger platforms, and for those who need a longer driving range. I, I think you look at Hyundai and the introduction of their fuel cell technology, this is going to happen. There's no question. We were on the cusp of something really revolutionary with respect to fuel cells. Those who drive these cars say the change is all in the market, not in their lifestyle. I have found that it's had zero effect on my day-to-day -day work, and I'm, I'm very active, and I do have to uh, travel a bit in, in you know, Orange County, L.A. area, and uh, it has not had any negative impact on uh, those plans whatsoever. These fuel cell vehicles arrive behind a wave of better-known zero-emission vehicles, the electrics. BMW has introduced a line which includes a motorcycle-sized fuel tank and engine and some of its electrics to help drivers who worry about the range of battery-only vehicles. American automakers GM and Ford have made a big leap into the electric market. This year, nearly a quarter of Ford's display was electric cars, and General Motors is rolling out more electric models, too. In fact, this market is growing so fast, even Cadillac has joined the electric parade. We thought the market was ready uh, to start essentially tap into this whole electronic age, electrified vehicles. So if you want sensory overload, an auto show will definitely fill the bill. And while you're there, you might watch the future arrive. Adios.